you got this error message, don't panic. In this video, I'll be showing you how to open a new Premiere Pro project in an older version of Premiere Pro. First, search for 7-zip and download the version that's best suited for your computer. In my case, I downloaded the first one. Once you install it, right-click on the Premiere Pro project that you want to open and make a copy of it. Then right-click and select Paste. You can skip this step if you want but it's always a good idea to have a backup. Next, right-click on the copy you made and select 7-zip, then Extract here. Afterwards, right-click on the file that appeared and open it with Notepad or any other writing program. Don't be overwhelmed by all these codes, there's nothing really much for you to do here. The only change you need to do is in the fourth line. Now that you found the fourth line, all you got do is change this number into 1. Then save it by holding the Ctrl key and S together and close notepad. Afterwards, right-click on the same file and choose 7-zip, then add to archive. Change the archive format into gzip and click OK. Then you'll get a file like this with the gz extension. Now all that's left for you to do is to change the name of the file extension. Right-click on the gz file and select Rename. Then replace gz with prproj. Click Yes to these and that's it. Did this video help you? Let me know in the comments below. If you found value in this video, make sure to like it and subscribe to my channel. Share this video with someone who's having the same problem. If Premiere Pro keeps crashing on your computer, you should change the settings I have mentioned in the video on the left. Contact me if you need video editing services and I'll see you in the next video.